last year, when the floods started, when the fires then started, it became very apparent that First Nations communities were impacted more than any other communities in British Columbia. Our relationship with the First Nations communities was not strong enough to really provide them the equitable kind of emergency management support that they should expect from the province. And so the First Nations liaison officer positions were created to make sure that we had dedicated expertise in the provincial emergency operations centers. The First Nations liaisons played a, a real coordinating role, so um, identifying what the problems were, figuring out who had the solution within all of those different agencies, whether it's non-government organizations, different provincial ministries, First Nations communities. There's, there were lots of First Nations communities who stepped up and helped their neighbors. The First Nations liaison was really critical for our wildfire 2017. To have that one person to be able to talk to them and be able to say, this is what's happening, can you help me with this? It made it so much easier to have that one person to go to and then solve some of the issues that we're having. I really think the personable approach that they had for us, that we were able to approach them in any way, shape or form with a problem, was perfect. They handled it very well, very professional and very fast. I don't think it's hyperbole to say that we transformed the way that the province deals with First Nations on emergency management issues during the course of the event last year. The creation of the liaison officer position was one of those, but it was more about what then did we do with that position and how did the province respond? It's about the communication, it's about those relationships and those partnerships and, and the liaison officer positions really helped us establish that. It is all about service excellence, it's all about partnership. It was developed because of the collaborative approach that we wanted to bring to working with First Nations and Indigenous organizations. It actually, in my view, is reconciliation in action. It really is about working with our partners. It's about making a cultural shift within government, especially in an organization that really has to be thinking about immediate emergencies, but making sure we're doing that in a culturally appropriate way and providing service to First Nations and all British Columbians so that they know that they're safe. In partnership with the Ministry of Indigenous Relations and Reconciliation, First Nations Emergency Services Society, our work with the First Nations Leadership Council, we've really been able to transform that relationship. And so we're now at a point where I think the trust has been established to a much greater degree. And we're now able to work together so much better.